In modern physics, they say everything is energy, and in these thermal images, we can see everything is radiating energy. If our eyes were more sensitive to the different wavelengths of light, we would be able to see that everything is continuously exchanging light or photon energy. But if the great game of life is formed out of temporary waves of energy, there must be a creative process with new waves being formed relative to the energy and momentum of our own actions. In this theory, this creative process is formed by the wave-particle duality of light and matter in the form of electrons. We have a process of cause and effect with wave-particle duality forming a blank canvas that we can interact with, forming a future relative to the energy and momentum of our actions. The future is unfolding photon by photon with each new photon-electron coupling or dipole moment. It is the spontaneous absorption and emission of light relative to the atoms of the periodic table that form the ever-changing world of our everyday life that we see and feel as a continuum of time. We have a universal process of energy exchange with photon energy oscillations or vibrations only occurring once and then they are gone forever just like a moment in time only occurs once and then it is gone forever. When there is a photon-electron interaction there is matter-antimatter annihilation with the formation of a new quantum wave particle function or probability function. In this theory the antimatter annihilation represents the past being destroyed and becoming part of history and the formation of a new quantum wave particle function or probability function represents future possibilities and opportunities at the smallest scale of the creative process. In this way we have a potential uncertain future relative to the atoms of the periodic table with the mathematics of quantum mechanics representing the physics of time with classical physics representing processes over a period of time as in Newton's differential equations. This would explain why there is no concept of time in the subatomic world within the atoms. It is because the process we measure as a period of time is formed by photons interacting with the electrons that surround the atoms. At the smallest scale of this process the Planck constant is a constant of action in the geometrical process we see and feel as the passage of time with the uncertainty and probability of everyday life represented by Heisenberg's uncertainty principle. In such a theory the time dilation of Einstein's relativity is part of the creative process with energy slowing up the rate that time flows as a universal process of continuous creation. With electrical potential, gravitational potential and the potential uncertainty of everyday life all being part of one process. As part of this process of energy exchange, each object or life form will create its own reference frame relative to its position and its energy and momentum. Therefore, each observer is in the center of their own reference frame with their own personal individual view of the universe. Each observer will interact with the wave-particle duality of light and matter with the future unfolding relative to the hand and eye of the beholder. Please share and subscribe. It will help the promotion of this revolutionary theory that gives us an objective understanding of time as a physical process.